YouTube. What it do, family, man? This is your boy, Ill Wise, man. Yo, if you're new to the channel, man, go ahead and hit that subscribe button for me. You know what I'm saying? Like this video, man. Go ahead and show your boy some love. You know what I'm saying? Why not? Why not, man? Today, I want to give you guys a little video. As you can see, got my four-way flashes on. Got my cones out, man. Um, got here a little too early. It's fine. I was going to go ahead and skip a stop, but I do not like skipping stops, even though I know my route. Um, it'll be out of the way and I have to come all the way back to this stop. It doesn't make no sense for me to do that, right? Uh, this video is gonna be called uh, What They Do Not Tell You uh, When Coming Into This Game, man. Food service, food service, another food service video, right? Uh, first things first, man. Um, start time you will have to wake up real real early man we talking 2 3 a.m 4 a.m in the morning man ask yourself are you ready for that right um i was but are you ready for that they, they're not going to tell you that man but you do have to wake up early in the morning man highly recommend get some breakfast i just started doing that so that's one thing so far that you guys should know right um, be on time, man. I highly recommend that you get to your drop yard, warehouse, where you know wherever you have to, you know, you're stationed at at least 30 minutes, 45 minutes ahead, because um, you got to leave yourself open-minded because you never know. Sometimes the trailer might not be there on time. They might have loaded your trailer the wrong way. You know, you have time to to, to make the proper adjustments. You might have a flat tire. You know what I'm saying while doing your pre-trip things that I need to see. You always want to be ahead of the game, right? Okay. Um, also, they might not tell you that you might have to do a lot of backing, man. Um, coming into this game, you know what I'm saying? You just got your license, you know what I'm saying? I highly recommend that you get at least three months experience, man. Three to six months experience when coming in. But if you feel like you're able to do the job in a company, rather it's Cheney Brothers, Cisco, G GFS, you know what I'm saying? We can, you know, we can go on for days, man. Um, if they end up hiring you, man, go ahead and take a shot. By all means, um, you know, that's that that would be a great that'd be a great deal for you. You know what I mean? But at the same time, um, just keep that in mind, man. Just keep that in mind. As well as what else I can say, customers. Um, you can't you can't teach customer service. Um, you know, you either, you either got it or you don't, you know what I mean? But I highly recommend um, treat everybody, you know, with respect. And then, you know, just see what comes with it, you know, as you're making your delivery. I'm on a trip, y'all. Somebody gonna peep that, you know what I mean? But, um, you know, you, some customers might like you, some might not like you, you know, for whatever reason. It is what it is, you know, it comes with the game. So I understand that, but, um, just see past that because there's no reason why, um, for example, out of 20 stops, one customer ends up ruining your, ruining your, ruining your day. Excuse me. Um, it takes a lot to get you know under my skin or whatever like that. So I just see past that, man. Took took me a while though. I was never like that, but it took me a while though, man. So um, don't let one customer ruin your day. You know what I'm saying? Um, for example. Like I told you guys earlier in the video, I'm here waiting for a customer to get, you know, to this particular stop because like I said, I'm here a little bit early. They're supposed to be here at 10. Right now I'm clocking it for 9.45 a.m. in the morning. Um, I've been here since 9.20. The only reason why I'm staying is because like I said, it's out of the way. So it only makes sense what? To stay put and just wait, you know, the extra 15 minutes, you know, why not, right? So also keep that in mind that uh, sometimes, you know, when you get to a stop and a customer's not there, you might have to wait. It is what it is. Um, especially like if it's only like 12 cases, 10 cases, it only makes sense to wait. You understand what I'm saying? <sighs> what else can we talk about? Also, um, put your four-way flashes on, you know what I'm saying? If you don't have any cones, Ask your company to give you some cones out because it will 
we'll kind of help other people who's driving by you rather it's another tractor trailer people who are driving their regular cars to, to to know that you're making a delivery somewhere nearby that area you know what i mean um what else can we get into um you will have to learn that scanner that's that's pretty much basic you know what I'm if you know whatever trainer you end up going out with you know what i'm saying learn from him or she and um just pretty much go from there you know what i'm saying like i said we all say it in all our videos but you can't teach anybody how to stack everybody has their own way of stacking the cases on the dolly so um you know find what works for you and just just go with it man um rather it's a, a mid-hand truck a tall hand truck you know what i'm saying just just get just get it going and and run that delivery in you know what i mean but yeah I can't stress it enough, man. You're going to deal with some nasty, nasty customers out here, for sure, for sure. But like I said, just do your do your due diligence, man. Do your job properly, the right way every time you go in there. Make sure you ask where the freezer goes, where the cooler goes. I'm saying where they put the dry goods. So you don't have no issues, man. You understand what I'm saying? Also, um, what they don't tell you, you need some steel toe boots man um every driver is different hint hint every driver is different you know what i'm saying some wear steel toes some wear safety toe some wear tennis shoes some wear sandals you know what i'm saying gucci sandals i'm just playing um but yeah man wear definitely definitely wear those uh steel toe them safety toes it's you know it's all about safety you know what i'm saying what they won't tell you but i'll tell you because i know i put a handful of guys on man got to wear that back brace got to wear that back brace man very very important um it doesn't matter how long you want to do this for it's very very important because one one bad lift your career is done 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 um i remember when i was in orientation i'm getting off topic but not really in orientation i watched the video and um, it is true, man. Most food service drivers, especially coming into this game, nine times out of a ten, they're done within three months. And that's not talking. They don't even last a year. You know what I'm saying? But most of those guys are done within three months. So just for safety purposes, get a back brace or just do the proper lifting. You know what I'm saying? So if I miss anything, man, my subscribers out there, man, make sure you guys drop it in the comments. Um, yo, my new subscribers, I appreciate you guys subscribing to the channel. This is my channel, man. So, yo, y'all take it easy. Y'all be safe. It is your boy, Wise, man. I'll catch y'all on the next one. We out, man. Peace.